हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू क्रिएटिव मेडिसिन इन दिस लेक्चर वी विल लर्न अबाउट antigenic structure and virulence factors in the gram positive cocci especially like the staphylococcus in the staphylococcus we have different antigens one we have peptidoglycan peptidoglycan is actually the cell wall component in the cell wall we have peptidoglycan in a gram positive cell wall this peptidoglycan here is more thicker and it is important for the cell rigidity and it will also induce an immune response so peptidoglycan is more thicker and it is important for cell rigidity and it will induce an inflammatory response then we have tcoic acid in the gram positive cell wall, all here to the peptidoglycan to the upper part you see some amino acid residues are seen chains are seen which are called as tcoic acid these tcoic acid will mainly help in mucosal adhesion and they prevent opsonization they help in mucosal adhesion and they also prevent opsonization and they prevent opsonization then the next uh, next toxic then then the next virulence factor is we have clumping factor or bound coagulase this clumping factor or bound coagulase is responsible for the slide coagulase reaction then we have one more factor which is called as protein a this protein a is actually antiphagocytic anti complementary and it is chemotactic because it is antiphagocytic anti complementary and chemotactic it binds to the fc region of the igg so in the igg it will bind to the fc region of the igg leaving behind the fab region free and thus it is important for the coagglutination reaction which occurs in the staphylococcus aureus thank you and thank you for watching